homes were destroyed. <laughs> Children were orphaned. A great wizard from Kansas. I've waited for you to come and set things right. Michelle Williams protagoniza una de las películas más esperadas del año, Oz el Poderoso. Pero esta respetada actriz de Hollywood dice que trabajar en un filme de esta magnitud tuvo sus retos. That was hard. That was a really hard transition for me to make. Uh, uh, I'm conscious of people watching me perform and then I walked onto the set and there must have been, I don't know, 20 different monitors set up because so many people have so many different jobs and they need to use these monitors and I realized I wasn't going to be able to like control things like I like to. So I had to let, I had to let go. Pero a pesar de sus inseguridades, Michelle dice que las dos personas que hicieron este proyecto tan conmovedor para ella fueron su hija y James Franco. It was special for me because I wanted to make something more kid friendly. It was special to share uh, to share this experience with. And your daughter, daughter was. You're a few feet away right now from James Franco. What was it like working with him? Um, it was it was really fun. You know, he's he's um, it's great to be around him because he's so full of ideas and he's so interested and he's really tuned in and kind of some of that kind of rolls off of him and you get to pick it up for free. Pues Michelle Williams y James Franco, igual que Mila Kunis y los demás actores de Oz, El Poderoso, hicieron un tremendo trabajo en este film. No se vayan a perder la mejor película del año, en mi opinión. Es el tipo de film que los niños y los adultos pueden disfrutar. Se estrena el 7 de marzo en Argentina, Chile e Italia, el 8 de marzo en los Estados Unidos y México y el 27 de marzo en España. Nos vemos en el cine.